Last night, the Hazleton area boys basketball team hit the court at Wilkes University looking to knock off Pocono Mountain West. And the Cougar faithful in attendance technically weren't cheering on the scarlet, silver, and white. Both teams showed up tonight wearing white jerseys, forcing Hazleton area to wear blue Wilkes uniforms. The Cougars may have been wearing different uniforms, but they still played the same way that they've played all season long. The beginning of the game was a bit of a feeling out process, and Josh Samick stepped up for the Cougars on the defensive end by blocking several shots and making his presence known on the defensive glass. On the defensive end, I think I played good. Uh, on the offensive end, uh, not so much. It was, it was a rough one on offense, but on defense, it definitely helps me. He told me he wants me to block shots as many as I can, so that, that's, that's what I did. He's our best defensive rebounder. He's our best shot blocker. Uh, he has, you know, stats that probably no player has ever had in the history of our school. 900 points, you know, approaching 600 rebounds, almost 150 block shots, over 125 assists. He's a Division II scholarship player for a reason. At the end of the first quarter, the game was tied at 12. But in the second quarter, the Hazleton area offense came alive by hitting shots from everywhere. Perhaps the biggest jump came when Demir Faison got the ball in transition and went up for one of three Cougar dunks on the night. You know, they say that those are only two points dunks, but at this level, maybe at the college or pro level, maybe it's not as big of a deal, but it's a bit demoralizing in a high school game. The Cougars led 29-21 at the break, and in the second half, Hazleton area continued to roll. Pocono Mountain West had no answer for Jeff Planudis, who scored a game-high 21 points. Aside from Planudis, Demir Faison would also put up big numbers in the second half and route to 17 points on the night. When it was all said and done, the Big H.A. poured in 40 second half points on way to a 69-50 victory, putting the Cougars in the state quarterfinals for the first time since 1995. We've been working towards it for years now, and it just feels good for us seniors and for everybody else on the team to finally make the quarters, especially being in the state tournament. And, and now we have a good, we have a big game on Saturday. So we're in the Elite Eight for the first time in a long, long time—the first time in my tenure—and uh, we're going to enjoy this for the next couple hours. And then we only have 48 hours to get to work against the District One champ. Hazelton Aries' next game will be against District One champ and Eastern Bracket favorite Abington. Reporting for SSP-TV Sports, I'm John Eric Poli.